When performing a search using ABC Clio, chances are you're going to get back a bunch of different results, especially if what you're searching for is a subject that is broad in nature. The trick then is to narrow the amount of results down to something more manageable, and we do that by filtering. So let's follow along as I show you how to do that. So let's start off by doing a search for Theodore Roosevelt, and we're going to search all the databases. I'm going to click on Go. We get our search results screen. You'll see each database listed with the amount of results to the right found within each database. So in American government database, there's 240 articles uh, on Theodore Roosevelt, there's 311 in American history, there's 17 in world geography. Now let's just start with American government. Once you're at this screen, you now have the option of browsing all 240 results. Um, however, that's a lot of results, so you want to get that down to something a little bit more manageable. And the way we do that is through filtering, which is on the left-hand side. So you can pick and choose what you want to filter by. Um, so for example, if you just wanted images associated with Roosevelt, you select images, press filter, and now you're down to 21 results. Um, you can pick as many as you'd like. So if you just want the quotes and speeches by Roosevelt, you select those two, and now you have 43 results. You want to go back, just unselect everything, hit filter, and now you have your 240. The other thing you can do is you can search within these results. So if you want to find information on Roosevelt and his time with the Rough Riders, I can type in Rough Riders. And now you'll get nine results, uh, all dealing with Roosevelt and the Rough Riders. So those are just a few examples of how you can use filters to get down that 240 number to something a little bit more manageable. Happy searching!